Hi, this is Doug. Another unboxing video today. And today I'm going to have the Saima X23W. Uh, nice looking drone from what I've seen. Uh, it's got app control. You can control it with the uh, transmitter or your phone. It's got a PV flight, they say. It's got a flight plan you can put on your phone. Uh, it's got altitude hold. Supposedly an HD camera. I don't know how much HD. Uh, this is a nice box. It has a lot of information on the outside of the box. Here it's got technical data. We've got uh, 3.7 volt, 500 milliamp hour batteries. It takes four AA batteries for the remote. So a lot of information on there that you don't normally get. And on the bottom of the box, say more information, man. Explains a few things. Does flips. Control with the phone if you want. You've got G sensor, uh, waypoints. You say, let's get into the box. Oh, here's the other side. I guess it comes in black or white. I got the white. Let's open it up. See what we got inside. Okay. Wow. This is a novel. This nice book, man. That's good size. Look at that. You only have to squint to read this one. <laughs> really nice, man. Pretty thick, too. Oh, it's got all the languages. German, Italian, English, and I'm sure French, Spanish. That's why it's so thick. But it is nice, man. It's good size you got your QR codes down here for Android or Apple you know okay further on let's see here we got bag has let's see it's got eight props four extras in case you get some damage you got your uh, caps that go on over to hide the screws, protect the screws. Put that over there. It's got this is a weird looking uh, USB charger, man. It's pretty weird. Look at that thing. Now that's because of this. It's got proprietary batteries. That's one thing I don't like. But you gotta have those sometimes in these nicer drones. And Here's your drone, but the thing that surprised me and I didn't know, this came with two batteries, man. That's really great. Extra flight time. I'm, I'm so happy with that, with two batteries. Especially being proprietary. You know, if they were just regular batteries, I've got other batteries I could add. Look at the camera on this thing. It looks huge, doesn't it? <laughs> just... Awful big thing looking at you. Here's the on off switch on top. Uh, when I first saw this, I thought it was going to be really small. It's a little bigger than I thought. It's got nice little rubber footings for soft landing. So it's good size. It's not big and it's not micro. It's a mini. Mini drone, pretty cool. It's got my favorite clip on there for your phone, chip clip type style. These things will keep your phone in place and will not drop your phone. Really nice to have these. I love these. Here we've got four prop guards. A little flexible, that's great. Can withstand a little punishment if you bump into something. 
I like how these foam inserts are all cut out for the individual items. What else we got in here? Oh, your handy dandy screwdriver, of course. And last but not least, you've got your transmitter. That's your on off switch. This is where your batteries go. 4AA, I believe it said. Now, I believe two of these buttons on top don't do anything. Uh, I think you got, uh, I forget up here, you got one for camera, I believe. Maybe the other one's for video. I don't know. I forget. You read it in the instruction book. Let's see, got even these <laughs> little foam things around to protect the uh, sticks. Really cool. Okay, these click. So they've got some function as well. Probably, oh, somehow you do the trimming with this. Probably pull that in and trim one way or another to do your trimming. Nice on off switch here. I don't know if you can hear that click. Pretty nice though. Uh, I wonder. Let me real quickly kind of look and see what this transmitter has. It's got me a little curious now. Yeah, the left joystick keep pushing in until trimming control is finished. To clear all the trimming setting, keep pushing and press the power button at the same time. Okay, so this button here does the flips. This button here is auto take off and landing. I think you control your video and photos on the phone itself. So, yeah, I don't like that. I wish these other buttons over here were for your video, but like I said, these don't do anything. They're just for some other drone, I guess. Uh, I don't know what else I can say. The right joystick, you can press and hold to enter headless mode. Oh, and this is how you change your uh, speed, too, from high to low. Got altitude hold. So, there it is, man. Your Sima X23W. Flight video up and coming, I promise. Uh, as soon as I get my camera and gear, and uh, I will have some flight videos instead of all these unboxing videos. So, if you like this, please like and hit that subscribe button. Until the next time, peace. Peace out.